If you are anywhere into research, doing PhD, thinking of taking admission for PhD, or you are in your final year, then you need to watch this video till the end because I'm going to suggest an excellent opportunity which will take your career to the next level. And I'm sure that you are going to enjoy this video and also get a lot of information about how to mold your career in some other way. Hi, hello, my name is Atya. Welcome to PhDpreneur, where we discuss about research, wellness, and PhD. Today, I'm going to discuss about a fellowship scheme, which is purely lucrative when it comes to financial prospects also and career-wise also. And that's called as Inspire Faculty Scheme. I know for past two, three videos, my appearance has been little unkempt. Please excuse my avatar for past couple of videos because I've been really unwell, but I'm trying my best to recover. So anyways, let's start with today's video. So Inspire Faculty Fellowship is something that you do post PhD. Okay. But then even if you are in fourth or fifth year, you can think and keep things ready with respect to documents, everything. And what is this is that many of the times after PhD, you think what to do. Okay, the job market is really scarce. Sometimes you apply, you don't get job. So in the meanwhile, you can apply for this. And it's a really prestigious fellowship. Inspire Faculty Fellowship provides opportunity to doctorates to do independent research for five years. So you will get fellowship for five years in both basic and applied sciences. So if you are anywhere connected to basic and applied sciences, then you can have a look at this. Okay, so including engineering, the areas include engineering, medicine, agriculture, veterinary science and translational research. So this is something that you can keep in mind while applying for this. So the main aim of this is to promote research. So many of the times what happens is after your PhD, sometimes the opportunities in research are really limited and you feel like you don't want to do research you will you rather go into teaching but we don't want that the government is really trying to push research in all frontiers and the deadline is 31st august 2023 so what are the benefits you get one lakh twenty five thousand per month with annual increment of two thousand then in addition you get a research grant of seven lakhs per year for five years okay so one lakh twenty five thousand is just your salary plus seven lakh per year, okay? And that is something I have not come across any fellowship which gives this much. And maximum period is for five years. You can finish before that, but maximum it's five years. So let's understand what is the eligibility. What all you need to have to avail of this. So you have to be an Indian citizen or an NRI, okay? Having a PhD degree. So you have to complete your PhD degrees. Those who have submitted the thesis are also eligible. Then minimum of 60% marks throughout your academic profile, starting from class 12th. So class 12, graduation, post-graduation, if you have done and throughout 60% or above. And upper age limit is 32 years for general category. For SC, ST women candidates, upper age will be 37 years. And for people with benchmark disabilities, upper age would be 42 years. So they have given quite a relaxation for different categories. Then if you have publication, then you need to attach it. Those who are in regular employment, okay, they are not eligible. If you are in regular employment, like you have a permanent job and you are applying for this, then you need to give a resignation at your job and then you can go ahead with this. Candidates who are in within top 1% in their class 12th examination for IIT, JEE or need rank holders, first rank holders in university, they will be given preference. So if you are somebody who has always excelled in the academic examinations, then I suggest you to apply for this because you are going to stand a good chance in getting through this position. How do you apply? You have to apply online. I'm going to share the screen recording just now so you know exactly where to apply and I'm going to leave the link also in the description box. Before you log up for this website, just make sure that you read the guidelines and how to get to the guidelines also i'm sharing the screenshot you need to have as far as the documents are concerned you need to have your passport size photograph class 10th mark sheets 
mark sheets of all qualifications if phd is awarded then phd degree certificate then caste certificate if you are applying through a reservation or if you are somebody who is with benchmark disability and you want that quota then you need to have a certificate for that um if you are employed somewhere and you are applying then you need to have appointment letter details of all your awards and achievements and your proposal so if you are going to work for 5 years then what are you going to work on what is the title so all that proposal details and everything you need the details of all this is there in the guidelines so make sure that you check out before you even start applying for this and i'm sharing the contact details on screen so if you have any doubts you can get in touch with these people i highly recommend indian government is coming up with lot of schemes and fellowships for the purpose of research and i really want to make sure that you get the knowledge of everything on this platform the deadline is 30th september so still there are two months as i'm filming this and i highly encourage you to apply it's a prestigious fellowship i still don't understand why they have kept the name as faculty because i don't see any teaching component over here so anyways it's best to apply if you have any doubts get back to me till the next time bye